Welcome to ReneeEnergy.com on YouTube, the hub for all things renewable energy and sustainability. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest innovations and insights in green energy, including cutting-edge developments like green hydrogen. Whether you're a sustainability veteran or just beginning your journey, we have something for everyone. Join us on this channel to explore inspiring projects for a sustainable tomorrow. We bring you the latest in renewable energy, sustainability, and cutting-edge technologies. And don't forget, for more in-depth information and resources, visit our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the latest updates and exclusive content. In the previous episode, we explored the advantages of solid oxide electrolysis cells SOIX, over traditional electrolyzers, highlighting their high efficiency, flexibility and heat source integration, and potential for cost reduction. In this episode, we will focus on the integration of SOIX with renewable energy sources, such as solar, wind, and geothermal power. We will discuss how the coupling of SOIX with these sustainable energy technologies can enhance the environmental benefits and economic viability of green hydrogen production. Solar SOIX Integration The integration of SOIX with solar energy systems presents a promising pathway for sustainable hydrogen production. One of the most attractive options is the coupling of SOIX with concentrated solar power CSP, plants. CSP systems use mirrors to concentrate sunlight and generate high temperature heat, which can be used to drive a steam turbine for electricity production. By integrating SOIX with CSP, the high temperature heat from the solar field can be directly utilized by the electrolyzer, reducing the electrical energy input and improving the overall efficiency of the system. In a solar SOIC integrated system, the CSP plant provides both the thermal and electrical energy required for the electrolysis process. During periods of high solar irradiance, the SOIC can operate at full capacity, producing hydrogen using the available solar energy. The produced hydrogen can be stored for later use or transported to end users, such as industrial facilities or refueling stations. One of the key advantages of solar SOIC integration is the potential for achieving high capacity factors. By incorporating thermal energy storage systems, such as molten salt tanks, the CSP plant can store excess solar energy during the day and continue to operate the SOIC even during periods of low or no sunlight. This enables round-the-clock hydrogen production, maximizing the utilization of the SOIC system and reducing the levelized cost of hydrogen. Wind SOIC Integration Wind energy is another promising renewable energy source that can be integrated with SOICs for green hydrogen production. Wind turbines generate electricity by harnessing the kinetic energy of moving air, and this electricity can be used to power SOICs for hydrogen production. One of the challenges associated with wind energy is its variability and intermittency. Wind speeds can fluctuate significantly over short time periods, leading to variations in electricity generation. To address this issue, wind SOIC integrated systems can incorporate hydrogen storage solutions, such as compressed gas storage or liquid organic hydrogen carrier, LOHC, storage. During periods of high wind power generation, the excess electricity can be used to produce hydrogen via the SOIC, and the hydrogen can be stored for later use when wind power is not available. The stored hydrogen can also be used to generate electricity through fuel cells or gas turbines during periods of low wind power generation, providing a form of energy storage and grid balancing services. This integration of wind energy, SOICs, and hydrogen storage creates a flexible and dispatchable renewable energy system that can contribute to the stability and reliability of the power grid. Geothermal SOIC Integration Geothermal energy, which harnesses the heat from the Earth's interior, is another renewable energy source that can be integrated with SOICs for sustainable hydrogen production. Geothermal power plants use high-temperature geothermal fluids, such as steam or brine, to drive turbines and generate electricity. The integration of SOICs with geothermal power plants can take advantage of the high-temperature heat available from the geothermal resource to improve the efficiency of the electrolysis process. In a geothermal SOIC integrated system, the high-temperature geothermal fluid can be used to provide thermal energy to the SOIC, reducing the electrical energy input required for electrolysis. The geothermal power plant can also supply the necessary electricity to operate the SOIC, creating a fully renewable hydrogen production system. One of the advantages of geothermal SOIC integration is the potential for continuous and stable operation. Unlike solar and wind energy, which are subject to diurnal and seasonal variations, geothermal energy is available 24-7, providing a reliable and consistent source of heat and electricity for the SOIC. This can lead to higher capacity factors and lower hydrogen production costs compared to systems that rely solely on variable renewable energy sources. Hybrid Renewable Energy Systems with SOICs 
While the integration of SOEX with individual renewable energy sources offers significant benefits, the combination of multiple renewable energy technologies in a hybrid system can further enhance the reliability, flexibility, and cost-effectiveness of green hydrogen production. For example, a hybrid system combining solar, wind, and geothermal energy with SOEX can take advantage of the complementary nature of these renewable resources. Solar energy is available during the day, wind energy can be harnessed during periods of strong wind speeds, and geothermal energy provides a stable baseload power source. By integrating these diverse renewable energy sources with SOEX and hydrogen storage, the system can achieve a high level of energy dispatchability and resilience. Hybrid renewable energy systems with SOEX can also benefit from advanced control strategies and energy management systems. These intelligent systems can optimize the operation of the SOIC based on the availability of renewable energy resources, electricity prices, and hydrogen demand. By dynamically adjusting the SOIC's operating conditions and the flow of energy between the different components of the hybrid system, the overall efficiency and economic performance can be maximized. Challenges and Opportunities While the integration of SOICs with renewable energy sources offers tremendous potential for sustainable hydrogen production, there are also challenges that need to be addressed. One of the main challenges is the intermittency and variability of renewable energy sources like solar and wind. This can lead to fluctuations in the power supply to the SOIC, affecting its performance and efficiency. To mitigate this issue, advanced power electronics, energy storage systems, and control strategies need to be developed and implemented. Another challenge is the need for infrastructure development to support the integration of SOICs with renewable energy sources. This includes the construction of hydrogen storage facilities, distribution networks, and refueling stations. The development of this infrastructure requires significant investment and coordination among stakeholders, including governments, industry, and communities. Despite these challenges, the integration of SOEX with renewable energy sources presents significant opportunities for the future of green hydrogen production. As the costs of renewable energy technologies continue to decline and the demand for clean hydrogen grows, the economic viability of SOIC-based hydrogen production systems is expected to improve. Moreover, the flexibility and scalability of SOICs make them well-suited for integration with a wide range of renewable energy sources and applications, from distributed small-scale systems to large centralized plants. In this episode, we have explored the integration of solid oxide electrolysis cells, SOICs, with renewable energy sources, including solar, wind, and geothermal power. We have discussed how the coupling of SOEX with these sustainable energy technologies can enhance the environmental benefits and economic viability of green hydrogen production. The integration of SOEX with concentrated solar power plants, wind turbines, and geothermal power plants offers unique advantages, such as improved efficiency, energy storage capabilities, and dispatchability. Hybrid renewable energy systems combining multiple renewable resources with SOEX and hydrogen storage can further enhance the reliability and flexibility of green hydrogen production. While challenges related to intermittency, infrastructure development, and system integration need to be addressed, the opportunities presented by the integration of SOEX with renewable energy sources are significant. As we transition towards a clean energy future, the synergistic relationship between SOICs and renewable energy technologies will play a crucial role in enabling the widespread adoption of green hydrogen as a sustainable energy carrier. In the next episode, we will delve into the potential applications and market opportunities for SOIC-based green hydrogen production. We will explore how green hydrogen produced by SOICs can be utilized in various sectors, such as transportation, industry, and energy storage, and discuss the market drivers and barriers for the growth of the green hydrogen economy. Thank you for joining us in this episode, and we look forward to having you with us in the upcoming episodes as we continue to explore the exciting prospects of solid oxide electrolysis cells and their integration with renewable energy sources. Thanks for tuning into the ReneeEnergy.com YouTube channel. We trust you found this episode enlightening and motivating. There's a world of innovation and opportunity in sustainable energy, and we're delighted to share this journey with you. Stay in the loop with the latest on renewable energy and sustainability by visiting our website and subscribing to our newsletter. Your support is immensely appreciated, it's truly invaluable to us. Don't miss our next video on new trends in renewable energy. Follow us on social media for the latest updates. Enjoy the video? Like, subscribe, and share for more green insights. Thanks for watching.